guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video. Now as you can tell by the title, full day of eating. You guys know what it is. I always post one full day of eating video per month and we are in a new month. It is April. I'm usually prepared for my weeks. Like I always know what I'm going to have, what I'm going to be making, but today we're winging it because I have no idea. Wasn't even planning on filming a full day of eating today, but I woke up and I was like, look, I don't, I don't know what this week is gonna look like, so let's just, let's just film it and figure it out as we go. I went on an hour walk. I'm not lifting today. I haven't had anything. Honestly, I just woke up and just went straight for a walk. I wash my hands really quick and then I'm just gonna start on my protein coffee and figure out what I'm gonna have for breakfast. <laughs> Got my protein coffee, so I'm just gonna have this until after, while I get showered and stuff, I just wanted to have something. And now that we're in April, is officially starting month four of my cut. Now I promise I'm gonna give you guys an update. I keep getting comments like, hey, what's the update, what's the progress? The progress is slow, but it's, it's intentionally slow. Like I just don't want to check very often um, because I plan for this to be like my final, like really big cut, so I'm taking my time way more than I ever have with the cut. I'm still enjoying myself. We went out for drinks um, this past weekend. I had water burger last night. Like I'm still doing things that I enjoy. I'm just giving myself a healthy balance, but I'm being more consistent than I'm not. Not being consistent, if that makes sense. So with that being said, their progress is going to be a little bit slower. So for the three months, I've lost eight pounds. And I'm okay with that. Now that's gonna be a lot less than what most people would wanna lose in three months and that's okay. Some people will lose way more than that. Like you can lose eight pounds in a month, but that's just not my intention. I'm going into the month of April. This is month four, so I will be kicking it up a little bit more. I will be being a lot more disciplined this month. We'll have this conversation at the end of April and I will finally give you guys a full breakdown of my progress. But I did get new packaging. I order a couple of things from on our axis. Black leggings and then, ooh, these feel different than the other ones. And then this new color that they dropped. What color is this? I don't know, but I like it. Moonstone blue. Tiny cotton tees. I love a little baby tee. I love a baby tee. So I got this one to match. Oh yeah, it's just a little baby tee. My boobs ain't out. So this one is definitely cotton. The other ones are more like sportsy, like workout type fabric. And it's all right. <laughs> it's like, yeah. I definitely like the other two more. Um, it's the mellow top is my absolute favorite. And then the new seamless tops. Those are two of my favorite. This cotton one, this little baby one is, I'll probably wear these more for, lounge yeah got it in white and then got it in black this will just be good to wear yeah i'm gonna wear this like with my jogger with like some baggy jeans maybe i make a little breakfast scramble kind of thing i'm just gonna have bacon potatoes eggs yesterday we had kind of brunch for easter sunday and me and Teron cooked for his mom and I made some potatoes. So this is like leftover. I will put in the description box like how I make my potatoes. Obviously I'm not gonna be making them on camera right now, but they already have like onions and bell peppers in there and then I'll put the seasonings and stuff that I use.
right, breakfast is done. It took all like maybe 10 minutes, but it helped because the potatoes are already done. But another option, you can get the frozen potatoes. So you can pop them in an air fryer or on the stove and then go from there. You don't have to chop up and cook potatoes yourself. People sleep on potatoes. They sleep on potatoes and they're one of the, the best carb sources. They're just filling and you can eat a lot more of them and they're way lower in carbs than I feel like most people think. I'm gonna just have it with water and I will be back for lunch, snack. I don't know, we're just seeing how the day goes. It is time for a little snack. Um, just cause I just want something small. I've been like a crazy snacker uh, recently, but I want a snack right now. Expiration date on this joint. Ah, oh, we good, we good. Chobani, zero sugar vanilla, and this is the um, lactose free. But with an apple. Peanut butter. Then I'm also gonna have a rice crispy treat. Oh, I forgot I had these. I got some mussels from Trader Joe's. There's 14 grams of protein in these. There's lightly smoked mussels. Honestly, when I snack, I just be grabbing random stuff and throwing them together. Ah, damn it. I broke it. Okay, we're gonna say that one for another time. Why are these keep breaking? I don't wanna get this oil on my shirt. Always have to douse my muscles in hot sauce. Okay, we got the breast crispy treat, half an apple, like it's probably like a tablespoon and a half of peanut butter, got my Greek yogurt, and then we got some mussels. All right, so I did tell y'all this was gonna be a random day. And uh, when my weeks aren't planned out, this is what it looks like. I'd just be grabbing random stuff, but I just try to make sure I get at least a good amount of protein in. Um, how much protein is this in this? Seven grams, that's probably like five, 14. Okay, so this is 30 grams of protein, which is phenomenal. So although I love cooking, I really do love to whip up a meal. A lot of times I don't feel like cooking. And when I don't, this is what the meals look like, okay? Quick, simple, ain't gotta cook nothing, go on with it. Be nice if I had some veggies to snack on, you know, carrots, maybe some mini peppers, but I don't. That's okay. All right, I'm gonna have this and then I will be back for lunch. So hear me out. <laughs> did I eat my entire little snack pack thingy? Yes, I did, but I don't think I would <laughs> mix those flavors again. All the sweet stuff was fine. It was the mussels and the hot sauce. And then, cause usually when I snack, right? I wanna have a little bit of everything. When I'm having like my adult lunchable or a little mini charcuterie board, it's totally fine to eat the salty and sweet. Now that, you can't eat together like that, okay? So I had to go and eat the mussels on their own, let that simmer down, cleanse my palate, and then eat the other stuff by itself. <laughs> um, so yeah, just something to keep in mind. I'm back, it's a little bit later, and I'm going to make, it's more like a late lunch, but I'm being lazy. I'm being lazy, I'm a lazy girl, majority of the time. I am just going to have like some frozen dumplings and call it a day um, until dinner, because I'm not super hungry. So with the little chicken cilantro mini wontons, you just get these at Trader Joe's. I love these things. Then the sauce that I use, I use the dipping sauce that they make, which is, or they have listed on the bag, which is like soy sauce, a little sugar, a little vinegar, water, little sesame oil. So this is lunch. Huh? 
the next thing I'm having. Now there's not a lot of protein in this, which is fine. All the other meals I've had today so far have had a lot of protein and dinner will have a lot of protein in it. But you know, just quick, something easy. Um, we're getting ready to go to the movies actually. So I'm gonna eat this now and then I will be back to show you what I'm having for dinner. editing Keisha here coming in to close out this video I have no idea what happened to the audio it's just gone it's gone I was pretty much saying that the dinner was fire there you can switch up the protein for these little tostadas obviously I did shrimp but you can do steak you can do chicken whatever you prefer um, I will put all the information down below in the description box so if you want to follow along any of the recipes there wasn't much cooking and there's also wasn't much veggies but you know It'd be like that sometimes but thank you so much for tuning in and i will see you guys in the next video